talk about your forecast and what's going on. 63, uh, your temperature this hour. We do have some clouds out there that we're dealing with this morning. I, I really think that the clouds are going to come into play. will likely be at around 80 degrees. I have us just over that for your high. If we see thinner clouds out there, could even hit the mid 80s today. So we'll watch closely for that. Winds out of the south southeast. They're going to be variable today. The wind is going to be at least uh, generally out of the southwest. But as you can see right now, it's actually out of the southeast as we're starting off. Dew point coming in 61 degrees this morning. Temperatures mid to low 60s out there. We've even seen some 50s at times. Somerset coming in 59 degrees right now. Uh, overall, things are dry at this point, but we do have rain showers just off to the west. A little bit more unsettled there, and that unsettled weather is going to try to sneak in later on today. I'm putting our rain chance today at about 30%. Could have easily have gone 20%. Very small the chance that you're going to see some rain this afternoon, but could come in the way of a couple of weak thunderstorms. 81, your expected high with that isolated chance for some rain. Once again, what does isolated mean? It means most folks are probably not going to see a drop of rain. If you do, it's not going to last very long. Winds out of the southwest, 4 to 8 miles an hour. Out the door, here's your forecast. 8 o'clock temperature, 67, 69 at 9. And the rest of the day, we're looking at a 1 o'clock temperature coming in 78, 80 at 4 o'clock. And your 7 o'clock temperature coming right in at 80 degrees as well. So the impact as we're switching over to Tuesday. We are going to have a tropical system, as say it said, will be moving along the east coast. And as it does, it will bring... Small impact for us here in western Pennsylvania. Better impact, though, higher impact for those who are going to be uh, in the western, should say eastern parts of the state. That's where plenty of rain and windy conditions are likely going to be. Hey, we do have some good news this hour. You can see just over the last six hours, this storm system really has shown signs of weakening, including what was trying to be an eye. Now we're starting to see an exposed eye. And we're looking at most of the convection as well on the eastern side of the system. That tells us all that this is not a healthy system. We're going to take some time before it uh, gets back going, if it does at all. So we'll say over the next 6 to 12 hours, likely weakening, but probably still staying pretty close to hurricane strength as it moves inland into South Carolina and North Carolina slides along the coast with wind speeds probably topping 40 miles an hour in a number of these communities. For us, we should see some wind gusts probably over 35, but besides that, small is going to be the impact as the system slides by. A little bit of rain showers is all we can expect for your Tuesday. There's your seven day temperatures staying around the 80 degree mark through Wednesday, and then we're warming up as we're finishing out the work week into the weekend.